Hello everyone, how are you all doing? I hope you guys are doing great. Uh, this morning I was in contact with someone, someone who is at the helm of the affairs of uh, the Nation Security Network. Someone who is among the top guys who oversees the security situation of Nigeria. And uh, as we were discussing, he informed me about the plans that will soon be carried out by the federal government of Nigeria. Uh, before I continue, May this year, I made a video. And in that video, I stated that the bandits in the northern part of Nigeria that are killing people are going to carry out an attack in Niger State. And that the military are aware of this uh, attack, but they are not doing anything to curb it. Within one week that I made that video, there was an attack in Niger State, in a uh, Shiroro local government area of Niger State. A lot of people were slaughtered, lives were lost, and uh, close to 2,000 residents were displaced. Today, why this... Uh, guy was uh, discussing with me or rather briefing me on uh, what is going to take place soon i was uh, so worried according to him there is a plan to arrest fani kayode and charged and charge him for treason they wants to arrest fani kayode charge him for treason because of his statements because of his stance on uh, the issues, uh, on the ills of uh, the nation. Renu Omokri, the former aide to Good Luck, Jonathan should be very careful of where he traveled to. He should avoid Nigerians in foreign countries because there is a plan to use Nigerians in foreign countries to attack him. These Nigerians will be given money and they will carry placards and they will accuse him of using Lia Sharibu to enrich himself. His life is in danger. Reno Mokri should avoid Nigerians in foreign countries. According to the reports, Abike Dabire is aware of this plan. Going by the plan, Pastor Biodun Fato Yimbo of the Koza Church may be arrested this weekend. They have perfected the plan of giving money to some youths so that they could stage a protest that will turn violent. In that protest, properties will be destroyed and they will call for the prosecution of Pastor Piodun Fato Yimbo and the police will get him arrested. They will use the destruction of properties, the violent protests as a major reason for his arrest. And the reason why they want to arrest uh, Biodun Fatu Yimbo is for them to use him as a test run for their alleged plan to creep into the body of Christ and create discord among church leaders, so that they could carry out their evil plans. Prophet Isa El Buba, who resides in Jos, the outspoken man of God, who is, an, who is not afraid of anybody, just like my father in the Lord, Apostle John C. Stoleman, is on the trail. The Fulani has me are trailing him. They are after Prophet Isa El Buba. Prophet Isa El Buba should be very, very careful. He should be very, very careful because they are after him. He's among the people that they have, that is on their target. Also, Apostle John C. Suleiman would be attacked also. The government is not happy with Apostle John C. Suleiman over his stance in the situation of Nigeria. Recently, Apostle Suleiman said that Obasanjo 
spoke the minds of Nigerians in his letter. The government of Nigeria is not happy with that statement. According to the sensitive uh, security uh, information that was uh, leaked to me by this guy, the terrorist Fulani Hesmen will be used in collaboration with some Edo State indigenous to attack Apostle Suleiman along Auchi Okene Highway or Auchi Bini Highway. This is their plan. Very soon, there is going to be an helicopter crash in the northeastern part of Nigeria. When this helicopter crash happens, check the names. They are going to be the names of the Sultanas. And also, according to the information that was revealed to me, Boko Haram has been tipped to unleash attack on Nigerian soldiers this weekend. And those who are going to be involved, who they will attack, will be Southerners. The Northerners also have perfected plans to attack Southerners living in the North. And majority of the Southerners that they are going to attack are going to be the Igbos. This is their plan. This is the, uh, this is the plans that the APC-led government have mapped out. Before I round up, Olusegu Obasanjo is still your target. Soon, something is going to happen in Anota. Something is going to happen in Ogun State. There is a frame-up that they are planning to cook up. Soon, I will review more and more. Thank you.